Today's video is sponsored by Envato Elements. Today, I am grabbing a bunch of spooky photos and have only 30 minutes to turn these into something epic using Photoshop. Why do I feel like this is going to be a disaster? Ladies and gentlemen, today we are doing yet another challenge, but first I want to tell you something else very quickly. In the Halloween Photoshop contest announcement, I said I was going to reveal the prizes in the next video, and this is the next video. So therefore, yeah, well, here are the prizes. The three winners of Benny Spooky Edit War will receive a Razer Care Package containing a Razer Huntsman V2, a Razer Basilisk V3, a Razer Black Shark V2 Pro, and a Razer Strider. Now that is worth something. Best of luck if you're still gonna join the contest and then right now let's uh, let's just get straight into the 30 minutes challenge. These are the photos I found for today. All of them are from Envato Elements except for the portrait of course, that's mine. Let's just not waste any more time, let's go. And here we are in Photoshop. I have the clock ready down there so uh, let's just go ahead and get straight into it. I'm gonna turn it on right now. There you go. First of all, obviously, I'm gonna drag in the most important photo, which is me on the chair. Let's put it right there. And then I'm guessing we can just put this one below it like that. Then we also have the sky, of course. There you go. Uh, and then the other stuff. Oh, yeah. And the trees, of course. Here are some trees. Very good. So that's the basic stuff. And maybe the moon as well. I'm just gonna be chill this time. I'm not gonna rush myself. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna try to keep my shit together for the most part. So then for this sky, I am guessing this is not so bad. So let's just keep it this way. Then the moon has to be behind the clouds, of course. First, let's go and make this look nice and dark and moody and a little bit bluish too. First, a lot darker. Then I'm guessing we should add some blue to it. There you go. And that means that the sky should also be quite blue. I'm just gonna start back here just a little bit. For a start, this shouldn't be too bad and then maybe on this side it should be a bit more orange because of the lighting behind it there you go beautiful why do i feel like this is going to be a disaster uh the moon is going to be very nice and big something like this is actually not so bad and then i think i can just go ahead and use some blend if never mind yes i guess this can work just like that set the blend mode to screen and then using this Hello. Using this, we can simply... Uh, using this, we can make a very subtle, nice glow. Very soft. We have 23 minutes left. Let's see. Uh, I'm gonna bring all of this down. And then I guess we're going to have to work on me for a bit. First of all, I have to be a bit darker. However, now we also darkened the highlights, which we do still need. So let's see, maybe using this just like this. That is not working. No. No nope. paints all over the brighter areas. Now, before doing anything else, the most important thing is shadows. And we only have 18 minutes left. Uh, that's not great because I have still a lot of stuff to do. I'm just gonna make a very, very quick shadow. This is gonna look horrible. Okay, I guess that's not hideous. So then let's make my shoes a little darker. Uh, the stress is starting to kick in. And some shadows on those as well, where they're touching the ground, of course. Not really how it works, but sure, whatever, we'll take it. If you hadn't noticed yet, I'm trying to get the same sort of vibe as the music video I made. And uh, green really fits, especially because it's all razor, you know. Then I think we can very easily just kind of paint some green over this. There you go. Yeah, I guess that works. I guess that works. Same goes for this text. I completely forgot about the trees. Let's kind of remove uh, the sky of them. Make the edge look a little bit better using the refine edge brush. Pretty sure it's not made for this, but it does the job. So you don't hear me complaining whatsoever. 13 minutes left guys this is not gonna work i'm never gonna be able to include all these pumpkins to this so it right about there oh this is gonna not no nope not gonna lie that is uh, a little bit better it's still hideous let's just go and add even more haste to the background anyways i have to move on to the pumpkins right now because i'm not gonna make it otherwise first of all there's these which actually i still have to mask out as well so let's just do that with quick selection because it's nice and quick there you go something like that doesn't really matter for this one there's the first one then let's do the second one as well okay i am starting to stress uh, 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 a little smaller let's put this guy yeah uh, right there and this guy a little bigger maybe just right next to it a little bit behind my leg there and the very angry looking guy there have to be some smaller ones as well i feel like that's nice how are we gonna do this in 10 minutes there's no freaking way uh 
Uh, <laughs> let's start with these first. I'm gonna make them very dark as usual. Then I'm going to add some blue. Let's see, something like this. Oh, this is not gonna work. This is not gonna work. And then let's copy this stuff to all the other ones. Then we are already halfway there. A little bit of shadows on this one as well. Okay, this is looking still absolutely sad, but whatever. Then we are going to need some shadows below these guys. Hopefully that's gonna help something. Ah, oh, this is so- this is hideous. I almost feel bad for showing this to the world. Like, the other ones were always kind of acceptable, but this? I mean, it's 30 minutes, so it's shorter than usually, but still. Lighting-wise, there is so much wrong with this. It's incredible. Just look- for the highlights on these guys, I guess I can try something like this, but I doubt it's gonna work. I'm just gonna grab my brush and sort of paint over the top of these guys just like that. I guess it's better than before, so we'll take it. Now, I have fundamentally failed this time. This is, this is not, no. This is simply not great. It's not great. There's nothing we can change. Then maybe we have enough time to add a final glow and then a camera raw filter to hopefully make it look a little less hideous and horrible. See, something like this. Very nice. Then I'm gonna go to filter, camera raw filter and uh, yeah, do what actually? I mean, really, we cannot save this anymore. It's, <laughs> there's, there's no way this is, no, there's no way. You know, it's bad when not even a camera raw filter can fix it. That's when you know you really messed up. <laughs> I wanted to do so much more to this, but 30 minutes is just too short. It's funny to see how much of a difference 30 minutes makes, because usually I do an hour. And I always get something at least a little fun to look at, but this, this just kind of makes me sad. It's not even better than it was before. I mean, we still have one minute left. You know what? Let's just go for... The eyes. This is gonna look absolutely hideous, but it's fine. It doesn't matter. There's no way I'm gonna finish this in time. <laughs> and his mouth as well. <laughs> yeah, no, there's really no point in trying, but I'm doing it anyway. These two are gonna have a face, and this one is gonna have a face. 32 seconds. Finally, hurry, 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 hurry. And then I'm gonna make it green. Green, green, green. There you go. And then maybe uh, we can do it, we can do it, we can do it. Just a little bit of glow. Come on. Just a little bit. There you go. And three seconds left, and that's it. This is, this is it. Let me re-add the same camera raw filter though, because that's, I mean, that's fair. Okay, well, I mean, looking at it now, for 30 minutes, it could have been so much worse. But, uh, no, this is not my best work. That's for sure. But I am very curious what this is going to look like if I give it as much time as it needs. So that's exactly what I'm gonna do. First, however, a quick word about today's sponsor, Envado Elements. If you'd like to do similar challenges as this, all of these photos are from Envado Elements. On there, there's great collections of stock photos you don't find anywhere else, which you can use for whatever project you want. Personal, but also commercial projects. Same goes for everything else they have to offer, 3D assets, stock videos, and templates. You may even know they have Photoshop assets, like brushes, actions, and layer styles. This month, I particularly like the Halloween stuff, obviously, but for example, these bad overlays I'm using, all of that fun stuff I don't have time to do myself comes from here. You can imagine it's been a massive help in the creation of the latest Halloween music video I made as well. If you want to have access to all of this, simply get a subscription. For only $16 a month with an annual subscription, you're all set. Link in description. So, now that we can do this one without the time limit, I'm pretty sure it's gonna impact improve a lot. Let's go and see what happens.
not gonna lie, I'm still not in love with it, but at least we can all agree that it's a lot better than the first one. I also made yet another version in which I added some bats and some smoke just to spice it up a little bit more, and that really does make a difference, even though it's a small thing. The moral of the story... 30 minutes is too short to make something like this in Photoshop. If you like this video, make sure to leave a like and a comment. And if you enjoy my overall content, feel very, very free to subscribe. That would actually mean the world to me. And I hope I'll see you in my next video. Welcome back to Benny Spooky Edit.